Hey guys, this is uh, Richard from Wild Shatterag, another video for you. This time it's the Ultra 120 Extreme Rev.4 uh, White Air Cooler from Thermorite. And what I will say is this is the best air cooler I have had so far. The best one so far. So, continue to watch, let's get into it. Right, so I've got some benchmarks. Now, this is... I will say hands down, it's an unbiased completely, but this is the best performing CPU cooler I have received. That includes, it beats Be Quiet, it beats Silentium, and it beats all the rest of Thermalright's CPUs. It even beats the Thermal, uh, the Peel Assassin, it beats the Frost Commander, it uh, beats the Frost Spirit, ARGB, Hands down beats them all. This even beats an AIO. So, intrigued yet? Because, honest to word, honest God, this is the best performing air cooler ever. This is the lowest idles and the lowest maximums I've had on any other air cooler I've received. So, what we'll do is we'll enter the benchmarks and I'll make sure to put them up on the screen for you and we'll get into it. Now, Cinebench R20 was an idle at 28 celsius max was 61 61 celsius and r20 cinebench r23 was an idle at 28 the max was a 62 performance test idle was 28 max was 62 3d mark cpu test idles were 28 celsius the max was a 59 celsius and then i put in cpu z uh, stress test for uh, 5 minutes, idle was 28 and the max was a 59 celsius now if there's any any indication on uh, how this beats anything I've previously had well majority of the air coolers I have tested have gone above 62 degrees above now it is on certain tests head to head would be quite the Dark Rock Pro 4 now this is a very premium product. It is a um, on the twentieth anniversary. It is part of the twentieth anniversary product line. The fans that they've got included here are basically the same ones that they have for their uh, new RGB fans and stuff like that. Now this has got a lot of heat pipes, as you can see, loads of heat pipes. I count six. Yeah, six heat pipes that spread around. The fin rays, which is really weird. Look at the angle. As you can see, look, the fans fit in these little grooves. Now, it's really weird because one side it's going that way. The other side then it's going that way. I, I don't know, but this has, got, had, this has had the best airflow as well. The airflow on this is a monster. It pushes so much air. These fans are... Um, I believe these go 1800 RPM and these are, they're, they're a little bit loud, but I will give it for performance. This is absolutely fantastic of an air, co air cooler, hands down the best one I've had so far. So this is a more of a video of saying, basically, I recommend you go buy it. If you can find this in stock, go buy it because it is. Second of all, the system is a Ryzen 3600. It's a B450 uh, MSI Tomahawk motherboard, 36, uh, 32 gigs of RAM, GTX 10, 1050 Ti. It's got a 650 watt power supply and it's housed in the Dark Bay 700 from BeQuiet. Now, the it's 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 quite uh, strange because my 3600 from my 3600 from AMD, the Ryzen 3600, is it's got no overclock, it's got PBO enabled, and everything is on auto. So it means it will pump as much voltage and as much frequency into this chip. Now, I have seen some air coolers reach 68 degrees, a lot of them. That is basically the Burst Assassin, there's the this one by here. Which the Assassin Spirit, my late, my, uh, not my latest video, just the one before that, it sucked. It was so loud, I just could not believe it. This is a lot quieter than that, and the aesthetics are stunning. I love the all, 
white over the all white and the actual it is got a lot of weight to it the fans they're fantastic they have got uh, obviously the, the fins by here is basically these are air, air pressurized fans they are pressurized fans the static pressure static pressure fans so they're going to have a very good output when it comes to uh, cooling and if you can get it in stock if I find a link I will definitely let, let it down down below because I believe this is a fantastic air cooler and the aesthetics are fantastic. I will make sure to put up a few pictures for you guys to see. And this is Richard from Wild Tech. I hope you have a fantastic day. Please don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like. Also, don't forget to check me out on TikTok, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And this is Richard from Wild Tech. Goodbye.